Oh, yep, here's where doors. So he did this one. We don't need to go back mm. there. It's locked. Okay. It's locked. Oh, that's right. I need to give it to the white rabbit. Ah, made it back. One world at a time, is it? What a bother. I want to fuck that rabbit. Catch it. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. You covered one of them. I'll collect everything you picked up in the world as well. These will soon vanish at any rate. Alice seems to be hanging on by a thread now. In the torn pages, I'll put these together. Here you are. Tamed a burgundy notebook. Now then, I'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. Oh no, it's the cat bitch. He came out, not without those rules and those threads, you know. I wouldn't make nothing like that, but just give it time he sees. Making all these dumb rules he does. Bah. But we gotta fight. Just gotta follow. Cause if we don't, we be able to get punished. What can a guy talk like about what he likes? What you consider normal is gonna vary from person to person. Boy, you look like a wreck. Don't need to get so whooped up about somebody you just met. Doesn't that just wear you out? Oh, or did you forget all that too? I knew everything, because I stole them. Not giving it back, of course. Don't tell me. Is it really empty inside you? Is there even the slightest kind of anything? What the, the fuck? fuck is that question? <laughs> right. Is there even the slightest kind of anything? Sounds like your kind of writing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very extremely dangerous factory work. <laughs> This is the way he's speaking, just me sleep deprived writing. <laughs> but it fits the character. Yeah. So, might be? Not sure? Yeah. Not sure, it might be. Hey, not really seeing it myself. Hey, it's time. Bye now. So probably this door now. Yep. Oh, it's the teddy bear girl. As you can see, I named them accordingly. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I can't imagine where you got that name. Now let's see what abuse they went through. Fuck. It's Alice. Right to play, stay silent. We can just abandon them, leave them to their own trauma. Damn. Just watched a whole bunch of enemy soldiers open fire on a random tiger. <laughs> There's even more teddy bears in this world. Damn. I wonder if this is gonna be like Goldilocks and the three bears. Mm. Wait, was it Goldilocks? Or what, am I thinking of something else? I believe that's right. It's another bear. <laughs> Is this gonna be a bear in every room? Nope. Hey, hey Alan. Oof, you scared me. Um, uh, do you know where this is? A dream. Okay. Okay, thanks. Sorry, I'm not good at talking. But I don't hate it. Really. 
It was scary being alone. But I calmed down a little. Will you go with me? Okay. You want this? It's a blank sheet of paper, but okay. Here. Obtain a notebook scrap. Uh-oh. My, my mother has a very weak body. But I do the cooking, washing, and other chores instead of her. My father isn't home much. Sometimes she brings home... Sometimes she brings home a wolf or a deer. I want to go to school, but I love mother. So I always stay home with her. Mother always lies in bed saying, Sorry. I'm sorry. And her voice always sounds like it's about to fade away. Okay, so... I think I am gonna hop off. Okay. Having the headset on is hurting my head. That's but fair. I think it needs to be said. Um, playing Far Cry 3 and 4, and, well, Far Cries in general, are great. Because you can just be, like, like thinking up a very strategic plan to stealthily take out all of the guards at a strong po hold, or at a st strong post. Oh. oh, I wasn't going to read that. Oh, you weren't going to read that? Okay. Um, at a stronghold, and then some random shit happens that just completely changes the scenario. Because I, I'm, like, surveying a strong post, okay? I'm tagging all the enemies, thinking, okay, how can I play with their uh, having... How can I figure this out? They've got a dog, which is a real pain in the ass, because they're harder to deal with, and they can detect you easier. And then, uh, tiger... Random tiger shows up, kills one of them, but gets gunned down by the rest of them. I throw a rock to the other side of the base. The dog and two other men get confused and go investigate the rock. I shoot the one guy that was left behind with my bow. And then another fucking tiger showed up and killed the other three enemies. <laughs> Just completely randomly. I only killed one guy. I, I shot one arrow and threw two rocks. And I, I completed the stronghold without being detected because it's just random tigers showing up. <laughs> T Tiger got wanted to get revenge, <laughs> killing their wife or something. <laughs> yeah, it was actually like the first one was a standard tiger and the second one was a white tiger. Uh. So the white tiger was being a white knight, I guess. I don't know. Oh God. Anyways, yeah, well, yeah. I'm I'm a hop off. Yeah, see you later, have a, Hatchet. Have a have a have a good uh, existence. Thanks. Oh yeah, and it's very crucial that I mention I had my therapist laughing his ass off describing our editing streams. <laughs> nice. I, uh, talking with him, we we ramble about a handful of things, and basically I mentioned that. We were using that as a manner to actually motivate stuff, mm -hmm. especially in my brain. Because I don't know how, like, again, I'm frustrated that we didn't think of this sooner. Like, the only thing I can consistently motivate myself to do is come to your streams. <laughs> so, like, why did we at no point, or why did I at no point think, wait, what if we combined the motivation of the stream... And the fact that I need to work on writing slash help you with your editing. Bleh. Wait, the Forsake game is a four-player game. A four-player indie horror game. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, it's four-player. Interesting. The butt buddies <laughs> go through uh, a horror game. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, yeah. Yeah. Um, this is very extremely Dave uh, signing off, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Have a have a good one. I see you, Hatchet. Anyways, it, it, it won't it won't open. That's weird. Should be doomed.
Um, hold on, that was not their minute go. What the fuck are you? No, 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 no. Mm -mm. No, no. No, no. Sanju, if I'm here, if you're still here. Use your chant powers to make the, whatever the fuck that is vanish. I believe in you. I'm using my power, so fuck you to get out of here. Silence. The silence will kill whatever the fuck that thing is. Figure out what this bitch is. Good day. I'm really hungry right now. Ugh. If, if you need some medicine, there's some in the room over. But the stomach medicine needs to be mixed first. What was it? The first color goes. The second color yields. The third color stops. So green, yellow, red. That's what Grandma said, and it, then that refers to something. But she said it would explode if I messed it up, so I should stay away. Y you want to try? Says in three colors. Here it is. The mixed medicine in the order I said before. Will you, will you really do it? If you mess up, it's gonna explode. Be careful. Oh, you mix green, which one's next? Yellow, which one's last? Red. It, it, it didn't explode. Ooh, this should be okay. This medicine should work, I think. Tainted medicine. I'm an expert. And puzzle solving. We brought medicine. Thanks. Ah, much better. Feel great. All right. I don't need this, so take it. Take the notebook scrap. My grandma in the woods had a job making medicine. When my mother ran out of medicine, I'd go to grandma's house. One day, Mother told me to go there, like always. Today, she wanted to give a present, too, since she was indebted to her. It's full of bread and wine, but you're not to eat it along the way. Like I always tell you, don't stray from the path. Because there are scary wolves, I said I'd do what she said and left the house. While walking through the forest, I found a pretty flower garden. Oh shit, it opened. Here, 
take care of this door thing. Oh, it's unlocked. And a shard of what Hatcher said was porn. Smells like dirt. <laughs> job. Job, bud. Well, we're outside, but now what? Oh, oh. That's right before you came out and I saw a teacher. He said not to go anywhere. But I broke my promise. Should we look for him? Well, let's go to Grandma's house. Oh, wait. Can we pick a few flowers? <laughs> yeah, we're back to playing Tetris. better than before. Boom. <laughs> Ultimate Tetris Master. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> right. I might be running into some difficulties at the moment. Oh my gosh, stop giving me these pieces. Shit. 
It wasn't as long as I thought it was going to be. Oh well. Boom! Okay, knock it down a bit. Okay, knocked it a lot farther down than I thought it was going to be. Boom. 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 We're knocking it down. Another boom. pieces I don't want. Boom. That's right. The ultimate Tetris player. out soon. Boom. Yes, I got the achievement. I can just stop. I don't need to go any further. I got the achievement. Level 7. I, I probably wouldn't have even made it that far. Alright. I'll be right back. Danger noodles. Every fucking time. Same flowers. 
Thanks. I, I love the, the flowers here. Tell the truth. I'm told not to pick them. But it's just a dream, so... It's not the grandma's. It's straight ahead from here. Huh? No bridge? Well, now we can't get to grandma's. Oh. My head's spinning. In a dim. Hello, Alice and Alice. Don't, don't stare too hard. It's, it's deadly, you know. Just kidding. Don't creep. Say so you want to cross the river? I'll take you over. Not even kidding. But it ain't gonna be free. Just a little game. Love them, don't you? As you can see, I have here a, sh a wolf, a sheep, and a cabbage. You want to row your boat. Use your imagination. Get them all up to the other shore. Th there are a couple conditions. One, you can only carry one thing on the boat at a time. Two, if you leave the sheep alone with the cabbage, sheep will eat it. Three, leave the sheep alone. And the sh with the sh leave the wolf alone with the sheep and the wolf will chow down. They are the rules. Now, what's the minimum number of times you gotta roll across? Talk to me when you got the answer. Get it right, and I'll take you to the other shore. But yep, just like the rules of Alice Worlds, you only get three guesses. Miss up the third one, it's dead end friend. Alright. Get those ears turning. Hi, Jerry. Hi. I was being quiet because I didn't think you noticed me. No, I noticed. <laughs> but I spoke the truth in my DMs. What did you eat for that meal? Five guys. You still need more. Those are empty calories. Not if I believe hard enough. You know, it saves money to cook at home. Yeah, but I had a gift card. Oh, oh, fair. <laughs> So the psycho cat gave you a psycho riddle? Yeah. Did you shake it before you opened it? Yes, I shook it. Yeah, I actually remember this riddle. I remember being told it in English. Oh, do you know the answer? Yep, it's the it's the wolf sheep cabbage riddle. A, Is it a common riddle? Yeah. yeah. I've never heard of it. Why are you both like yeah, it's common? Okay, so if you leave the sheep. With the cabbage alone, it'll eat the cabbage. And if you have the wolf with the sheep alone, it'll eat the sheep. So what the re answer to the riddle is, is, you take the goat over, return to the other side, take the wolf or the cabbage over, return with the goat, and take the cabbage or wolf over, then return, then take the goat over. That's how it is. That's the solution. Yeah. Just the number, please. Anything else and I'm getting it wrong. So two. Nope, wrong. Too bad. Okay. So I actually have to do it repeatedly. Okay, this is going to be annoying. Okay, so it's... It would be... Two, turn on the other side. Then one, two. 
turn to go. Then take three. And go back over. And get this. The sheep. It's so hard because you don't type in the, the fucking thing. Okay. Okay, so the first one is the goat. We return the other side. Let's try the cabbage this time. Take the cabbage. Go back over. Take the sheep. Go on the other side. And take the wolf. Take it over. Then you come back. For the sheep. What? It's the fucking numbers is what's fucking me up. Because I did do it correctly with the actual riddle. Bastard. What? I looked up to see how to do the puzzle. It's not asking, like, it, dude, you take two, which is the sheep, go back over, get one, which is the wolf. No, it's asking how many times you go over and back and forth. That's you, fucked up! That you bastard! <laughs> you son of a bitch. Seven. Fuck you! You sack of shit! I knew the riddle too. So you take the you take the sheep over, take it over to the other side, then go back, get the wolf. When you go back over, you take the sheep, place it back, take the cabbage over to the wolf, then go back, get get the sheep, and take it all the way over. Done. Puzzle solved. That's how it is. And it's seven times you do it. You fucking piece of shit cat bitch. <laughs> oh, hell, correct you up. Alright, off with. On your way. Promise is a promise. Close the eyes. I don't trust that fucker. <laughs> Looks like the other shore. You notice there's a scrap in your hand. Oh, yeah, last world that we went dream world we went into uh the scraps of paper had heavy uh parental abuse i'm not sure if it's going to show up in this one. Oh. so yeah it yeah this game is a horror game okay don't stray away from the path i warned myself but i was sure grandma would be glad if i could pick her some flowers too so I picked a flower or two. Then a man came by and asked if I knew a medicine maker. He must have met Grandma. I told him I was going there too, so he should come with me. The man smiled and helped me pick flowers. Then we held hands and walked to Grandma's house. I don't hold hands with Father much, so it was sort of a new sensation. That's not a good sign. Yeah, uh, the last Dream World, it was heavily hinting that it's it, it was very similar to Hansel and Gretel. Oh. So I'm starting to think this is probably... Because the way she's dressed right now, it's Red Riding Hood. And we know what happens to the grandma in that story. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're spacing out? What's wrong? It's right here. Grandma's house. Let's go. 
I wonder if mother's okay. She's always been sick, but grandma says that she'll get better. Someday she won't wake up. She won't talk with me ever again. When I think about that, I cry a lot. Father's all red. It's scary. Uh. Alan, is there someone you want to protect? My character has memory loss, so I keep saying not sure to questions like this. Because <laughs> I can either be an asshole say, no, I am alone. Or say, I don't know. <laughs> oh, you lost your memories, huh, Alan? I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Let's go. It's getting a little cold. And it's kind of scary here. Fuck off Call of Duty and HBO Max. I'm not buying your shit. Huh? It's locked. After we came so far. What now, Alan? Hmm. Okay, so there's probably a key around here somewhere. Check the flowers. Or right, this. Oh, and what do you want? Hmm. Door's locked, huh? That certainly is weird. Seeing as that house doesn't even have a lock. Heh <laughs> heh. Well, there's a way, though. But you see, her squeakiness, me, is currently wanting a flower. Alright, I can't with, live without it. Bring me one, would you? What kind of flower is it? My, my, what a tiny weird voice you have. <laughs> uh -huh. I'll only say it once, so listen up. When she's red, she's passionate. When she's white, she gives pure XXXX. <laughs> when she's blue, she's internally devoted. And when she's yellow, she's deeply jealous. Ah, uh, but one last thing. She's very often mistaken for another. But unlike that other flower, she never hurts people. So don't make that mistake. Right off you go. Bring me the long one, and I'll have to eat you. We picked some flowers earlier. There's a bunch here. I'll split them up with you for you. I think you can save. Save, yeah. Uh, you brought her? Hurry up then, her squeakiness decrees it. One. Oh, uh, tulip, margaret, rose, pansy, or carnation. Try carnation. Well, well, you really brought her. Good job, Jerry. I was thinking, the last two lines gave it away in that... She's often mistaken for someone else, but she would never hurt anyone. <laughs> yeah, Jerry the flower expert. Ah, I'm, so... <laughs> I'm so glad. Finally, I can eat. Oh. Ah, sh sh she ate it. Well, what was she expecting? <laughs> oh, very tasty. Truly the best of the best. Ah, uh, yes. Something to, to open the door. Here you are. Obtained an axe. Yeah, this is Red Riding Hood. <laughs> oh, Red Riding Hood. Yeah, you keep it. It's too heavy for me. It's kind of forceful, but this should work. You there. Hold on for a Take this as well. Only for you. Realty has no need for it. And a notebook scrap. Uh oh. Ah. We reached Grandma's house, and Grandma waved to welcome me. The man bowed slightly too. The medicine is in the usual place. I went to get Mother's medicine from the back room. Just then, I heard a loud sound. There. There I saw. I saw a wolf eat Grandma. Yeah, Red Riding Hood. This confirms it. <laughs> oh. Then he stuffed a lot of medicine in a bag. 
Then he noticed me and started walking toward me. Grandma's dead. But please. Alan, you're pretty amazing. Uh. Oh. Buddy, I'm not an idiot. Oh, yes. I've been picking up these. Hatchet called this the shard of porn because it's just shard of XXXX. <laughs> Probably shard of uh, memory or something. Or medicine. Yeah. Oh, a key. The world key. That's actually what I'm looking for. So I can just fucking leave. So, I guess we didn't find teacher. And things are kind of weird here. It smells bad, too. Hey, how do you wake up from this dream? I see. Did it come from the other room? I... I... I don't want to... I don't want to move from this spot. Okay. But don't let go. Don't leave me. Please. Alright, bitch. I got an axe. I'm not afraid to kill you. No, you're not, Grandma. Wake up, wake up. All right, it's just a dream. I don't want to see it. Not again. I won't do it again. I mean it. Forgive me, forgive me. Use the axe, bitch. <laughs> Father. Red, the color red. I hate it. Stop. I close my eyes so I can't see. Hold my hand. Ain't a notebook scrap. I can't... I can't look people in the eye. I'm scared to hold their hand. It makes me remember it. If only I hadn't picked those flowers and hadn't met him and hadn't held his hand. Lots of blood came out. It smelled really bad. Teacher, I'm... Still a little scared, but I'm sort of okay. Teacher, I st can't. The, the the eyes, the core. I'm s red. Help me. Words turn toward the end are too blurred to read it. I believe I did the correct actions. If I just tackled it, the wolf would eat me. <laughs> Cause I'm pretty sure if you just jump on a wolf, the wolf's gonna uh, gonna look at you and eat you. And I know Chu yeah. will be excited for that, as they're in chat. <laughs> Sorry, I cut you off. Okay. Technically, since it's a wolf, it doesn't need to look at you just to eat. It has yeah. good sense of smell and touch. I'll come back. I say with a smile, but I'm made quite uncomfortable by that face you're making. Ah, well, at least you seem to have safely recovered the key. The job well done. Well then, I'll collect all the things from that world and put, uh, and I'll put together those pages. Here you are. Obtained a Vermilion Notebook. Now then, I'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. 